Hi friends! Welcome to A Wonderful Sheep. Today I am going to be testing out this diary from Daiso. I noticed Daiso stocked these new six ring binder diaries and they look pretty good. And it's also like a candy gummy bear theme, which I really like because I like gummy bears. So I thought I would go through it with you. It's got that PVC sparkly see-through jelly cover and so far it looks good. There's the cover page with the hard backing and then there are four different types of inserts. So the first is pink lined pages and then sort of a dusty pink plain paper and then grid style which I think you could use this for like a calendar setup and then finally small grid style like that. And I actually like the composition of this six ring diary set. I've been looking at the other diaries at like Artbox and there are a lot of like planner ones with like weekly spreads and stuff, but I think a lot of people use six ring diaries for like decoration and they want the freedom of having sort of planar inserts. So I think this is a good mix. If you want to do some more writing, you have the freedom of using these lines or if you want to do more freestyle, you can use the plain spreads. So I thought I would try out some diary decoration using this small A6 size. I'm gonna, I'm breaking out the tweezers. These are not stationary tweezers. These are actually for your eyebrows, but I wanna try using tweezers for stickers. Like I see all the professionals do. I think a good tip, I'll try this in the next spread, is to work from right to left so you don't run out of room at the end. Temper. Grr. The removable stickers do come off really nicely. This is an experiment. I'm mixing styles. I don't know if this will look good or not. Does that work? I don't know. <laughs> Let's see it does. is to, if you cut off the edges of stickers, um, you can reuse them on other parts of the spread to sort of tie the colors together. I think like the green goes nicely like that. Okay, so just wrote a little story about the moment when I remember seeing my friend buy a candy bar after an exam and hearing her explain that that was how she rewards herself after something difficult or challenging and I remember like never having thought of candy like that before and I started doing that which was not good and the ironic thing is that friend is a very healthy eater she eats like organic vegetables and cooks really healthy meals for herself and I was left with a really bad candy habit I like to joke to her about that that she led me down a path of destruction and <laughs> then left me alone on that path this spread 
This reminded me of like a weekly layout. So I'm gonna do the days of the week for one week and I'm gonna track exercise in here. So I'm gonna finally break into these very nice gold, which we call it gold edged letter stickers. I'll start with Monday uh, that I got from Rihoon Mansion. How do you use tweezers? Okay. And label the days of the week. These are also Zhu Hyang. Yeah, that's pretty. And we'll put something in Sunday as well to sort of balance that out. Okay, just leave that there. That's it for this spread. I'll fill this in as the week goes on. Hopefully have something every day for exercise. Oh, I should put, I should write exercise here. Am I gonna be able to fit exercise? Workout, workout. <laughs> workout. Found a little tree, gonna add that. And a little gold star. Oof. And another gold star. <laughs> there we go. Okay, now we're done. final flip through intro about my healthy habits challenge talking about sweets I'm trying to mix up the two different types of inserts more of a vintage style spread I don't know if it works it's quite busy and then a habit tracker for working out and I'll probably use a lot of little stickers in this spread Okay, I'm looking forward to using this A6 size binder. You have to use memo sheets in a different way than in the A5 and also stickers as well. But it's fun because I get to use my little stickers like this. This is hard to use in my A5. So yeah, looking forward to it. It's giveaway time. Like I hinted in the video, I picked up one of these six ring binders to give away to one of you guys. So it's the same as the one you saw in the video. It has the four different types of inserts and it's the A6 size. I also picked up some extra inserts to go along with it. This is a tie-dye set of different pastel colored tie-dye inserts. It does fit in the holes of the A6 binder, but the pages are a little bit wider than the ones that come in the binder. Also, this cute little hand mirror with gummy bears on it. It's a play on words here, but it means you're the prettiest, except it, it uses the word jelly. Also, these cute pastel glittery sweets and treats stickers. And some index stickers that are also pastel themed and uh, hearts and index stickers. I also went through my collection of stickers and memos and picked out some sticker sheets that I thought went along with the theme of pastel and candies and sweets. These are the cut it yourself stickers and the memo sheets as well. A lot of pink and pastel here. And I will be including these goodies inside this cute little file folder which I like to use to organize my memo sheets. It has three tabs, three separate folders and this cute little postcard, which I'll probably use to write my message on. Look at that. The final layout of the giveaway, I'll probably post on my Instagram because I'll probably go through and find more little things to add to the giveaway. And I'll leave the details of the giveaway in the description below, but be sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel 
and I wish you the best of luck. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.